Alright, I'm going to be playing through Majesty 2 on 240Hz difficulty. What does that mean? What do I mean by that? It means that I'm going to try and beat the main campaign while having my game run with an uncapped frame rate. I'll link to the video where I show that in the description, but if you've ever wondered why building sometimes feels really slow, or why monster dens just spawn so much stuff more than you remember, it's because this game has in-game timings and a tick that is frame rate dependent. It's tied to frame rate. So by playing the game at 240 FPS or fucking 480 FPS or 960 FPS, you are putting the difficulty up. Unfortunately, I'm only able to play on uh, nightmare mode at the moment of 240 hertz. So that's what I'm going to be doing. And be warned, I might unlist videos in this playlist. I might uh, have not much commentary going on at points during this playlist, but that's because this is a more completionist project that's just for me to do this because it's a challenge and it motivates me to do it. And I'm going to be uploading it just to have it there forever. Because I'm kind of like a completionist and a collector of good games and good runs and games on YouTube, so let's go. And also I have my own tricks that I do when I'm playing these games as well. Like, I, I am going to be safe scumming for this. Also the mouse is fucking annoying. Alright then, tutorial, tutorial, Greetings, your and we can actually manage to get First, a rogue majesty. that we can use for the whole campaign in this, so I'm going to be trying to do that. And I can show the building speeds being fucked in this as well. So, this is the build speed that I remember. This is what I remember having to deal with, but this is not normal, this is extremely slow. It shouldn't take this long for builds to go up. But now that I'm able to play on this hidden custom difficulty, there's no way I'm ever going to go back to playing the game the normal way. Like, this is it now. This is how I play through games, so be it. So, so be it. Let's fast forward. Look how long it's taken. Look, it's taken days to build this. Taking days. Absolutely taking days because I'm around 160 FPS. Look at that. It's gonna take four days to build a fucking guardhouse. Your Majesty, it is not becoming for the king to take to the battlefield himself. I wish there was custom keybinds, and I wish there was proper mouse. I would like a remaster of this fucking game. Heroes can be hired in guilds. And uh, let's check quick save and quick load. Oh yeah, we're in business. So I can save scum to get perfect heroes. For a start, your majesty. Once your peasants have finished building the guild, we'll start Man, this heroes. hidden difficulty is going to be a pain later on. Jesus. It's a challenge though. It's a challenge. Challenges are always a good way to revisit old games as well. And I... I advise you to upgrade the guild, your majesty. Special... Nah, I just want rogues. I want rogues because they're the ones that we're going to use. See when a mission is difficult, we're going to bring out the rogues. Bring out the rogues. I may actually upload this one in fact and just leave it public like the rest of them that are good. But this is going to be a project so I'm going to have it all on a playlist regardless. Give me rogues. Once I've got the three rogues, I can relax about this You'll need aspect. To entice your heroes to serve you, your majesty. Give them a task. 
and set a reward for its accomplishment. Different heroes like. I right, build marketplace. Good work, sire. Later, and I like the mouse as well. That's an incentive to actually play the game, like us to to experience the mouse. I want the rogue skills, so then I'm going to make three, and I'm going to fully recruit. Tell them to start putting down flags. Do we have the other? Health portion. Clerics, oh fuck off. Clerics and rogues is a combination. I mean, clerics and rangers is a combination that I don't remember really utilizing much. I would always pair clerics with wizards or warriors, but rangers could kind of work because they're somewhat tanky, aren't they? I'm gonna save. I like how the marketplace still has the Majesty 1 marketplace noise as well. Gotta research that, don't I? Do I? Yeah, had it right. And now I can make rogue skills good, so I want one, two, three. And then we get them all built, and then we make three rogues and save scum until we get the one we want. And I'm pretty sure it's. 1812. Alright, we have. Even the rate that monsters spawn in is way higher on this difficulty. Alright, I'm gonna. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Save scum. I'm gonna manually save as well. And now we can examine them. Eight, seventeen, nine. The gold? This might take a while. Eighteen, seven. Eighteen, ten. See, we're getting close already. We'll just do this a few times until we get what we want. Is there a shot, a hotkey for switching between us? Cycling heroes. Let's see if there's a hotkey for that. Next, is there next? Plus and minus for game speed. Uh, doesn't work. Where's Fuck off. Gold? Nothing fucking Where's works. Alright, loads. Where's the gold? Where's the gold? Where's the gold? Did I hear thunder outside? Whew. It's hot today. I love thunder. No. I think I heard thunder. Eighteen, yeah, look, eighteen, twelve. We want. That's it. So every time we get an eighteen, we roll a chance to get twelve, and that's what we want. We're gonna get there. We're all gonna have to do this save's coming a few times. It's the three rogues that you want, and then for the rest of the game, they're valuable. Unless you want to make more. Eighteen eleven. See close. That's it, that's exactly what you want. Looks like good eyes. Eighteen three. 
Where's the chance of an 18 roll? Is it a 1 in 20? So if it's a 1 in 18 chance, 1 in 18 and then 1 in 12, it's 18 times 12 as... Hundred and eighty two. I think. There's the gold. A reward for my toil. The gold. Nah. So it's a one in two hundred chance, so it should take about hundred on average to get what we want, maybe. One day this will be mine. So one in two hundred and four is it? Mine. Eighteen nine. So only things that matter the eighteen and the twelve. Only all the other stats are relevant. So twenty twelve times twelve is hundred and forty minus thirty six. Two hundred and four. Yeah, I got it. Two hundred and four. No. Why did I say a hundred and what was it? I said a hundred and twelve. 1810. We've had a few 1811s, so we're just getting unlucky. We're just getting unlucky. But this is most of this mission. 18 again. So it's gonna take. That means there's not an even distribution. Oh, an 1812. There we go, look. There they are. Lena the sneaky. All right. Well, we're gonna follow, follow her. Oh, what are you doing? Get your money. Right, let's see if this works. Yep. So now she buys potions. That's all we need though, now we just destroy the den. Which is my Exploring for your majesty is a pleasure. Let's <laughs> right, so explore this. Heal a speed heal a hero. Right, let's see if we can just yeah. I believe. And then it discovers it for us. Where to journey? And this is the one. 18, 12, level 1. That's shite. So that gives us a perfect playthrough of this. And we're doing it on Nightmare difficulty as well. Can't wait to see how bad the spawn rates are with our 90. I was doing it on a 28 super a few years ago. It's going to be even worse this time. Already the real estate value for my mansion has increased. You have great potential, Your Majesty. Onward to victory and the throne of Ardania. Alright, and this is it. Rina the Sneaky. 18, 12, level 1. <laughs> and that's it, and now we save. Can we save? Don't think we need to, I think we've got everything we need, so now we do the next one.